So we could Bad Moon Rising right now. But, what fun would that be? What fun would that be, you guys? Ooh, Here we go. <clears throat> Amazing! So we're actually ramping a whole lot right now. Uh-huh. We can actually replay a, um... We can actually play another Nebula now this turn. After we do this. What's in the box? Oh, it's Samba! What do you know? <laughs> this will actually draw us a gourmet card because of freaking, um, because of that. Oh, look! Leftovers! I love leftovers. What's going on, everybody? This is Fry. So, this week's event card is Bad Moon Rising. So, we're doing all Bad Moon Rising decks this week. No one can play. It's the best card in the game. Transforms all zombies into random guys that cost five or more. Uh, so, the idea is to put little things onto the field and uh, to play Bad Moon Rising and turn them into big things. Now, the combo that we're using with Professor Brainstorm is uh, the Disco Tron 3000, a card we rarely ever use. This has a few uses in the deck. Best thing you can do is put this on, uh, on turn six. It'll actually make two more little guys than Bad Moon Rising on seven. It's also possible to like teleport this in on turn seven. Uh, it'll only pop out then on turn eight. So then on turn eight, you'll kind of have all your guys scot-free in order to... Um, play the Bad Moon Rising. That'll be amazing. Uh, otherwise, you can play Nebula onto the field. This will give you two extra brains. If you play a uh, little eggy into the Nebula, so the the egg costs one, it'll give you two extra brains, and then the egg will hatch and give you another two. So uh, even if it was only, let's say, turn four, you'll actually have seven. You'll be able to Bad Moon Rising immediately. Uh, we're running Beam Me Up just for a minion, and we're running the Gentleman Zombie, which also gives you extra brains every single turn. The Tricksters are just so we have uh, some way of winning since uh, run, just trying to win with Bad Moon Rising and Garg Feast are not that reliable. We're running Garg Feast on 11. Uh, so another trick is to teleport in the Gentleman Zombie on turn 8. Um, and then on turn 9, he will pop out, give you two extra brains to be able to play Garg Feast, thus putting three Gargantuars onto the field. It's going to be amazing. Everything else is just for control or uh, teleporting things in. Hope you guys enjoy. Let's just get right into it. Instead of wins and losses, we'll be keeping track of troll score. Every time we get a good Bad Moon Rising or Garg Feast or Discotron or something, it's going to go down for real. So this is Nightcap, a pretty fast hero. Going to try to control him the best we can. Main thing you want in your starting hand is a Trickster. Oh, baby. And some removal. And uh, you sort of just, the first thing you gotta do is just stall for time. Get like to turns three or four and then try to get a Nebula on the field. We should probably be hard mulliganing for Nebula too. I could have gotten rid of the fruitcake there. Probably should have. Uh, best power to start with usually. The powers are very interesting. They're all very useful. I mean, Eureka gives you three cards, and any, you know, time you get three cards, you'll get a combination of good cards and then little guys that can just turn into you know bad moon rising targets that uh, we do have backup dancers this is the best thing to play uh with bad moon rising i mean you can literally play this uh you know into a nebula on six and bad moon rising then with two extra guys in the field we'll definitely save that uh telepathy will draw more cards in our deck which is perfect and then <laughs> we have two tricksters already the tricksters are used as a win condition to actually win games and also just a stall for time for your guard piece and for your for your stuff that's such a slow play. We have the perfect answer. This is a 2-3, which will survive, kill that, and makes our Tricksters cost one less. Amazing! Trickster is one of the best things to crap nowadays, if you guys are wondering. I don't know, is the Kabloom class really so good against this? I guess if they have like a lot of little banana bombs or some kind of field clear before you try to guard to um, Bad Moon Rising, that would be annoying. Okay. Let it blow. We won again! We won already! You guessed it. Aha, two troll score. Just because we won on turn three. You couldn't take it. The beam me up was putting too much pressure on, okay? You just packed your second trickster. Amazing. Getting tricksters in packs is just striking gold. Garg fees should cost ten. Just Captain C. What does the troll score mean? Um, 
Oops, it disappeared. It just means we get extra points for how often we, how much we troll people. Oh, Eureka! I think we'll go with Eureka here. Telepathy's better than Eureka. Two cards in your deck is so much better than three random cards. Like, come on, guys. One v one. If you win, I'll donate fifty dollars. That's it. Bo Shiel used to do that all the time. He used to give a donation. He would buy the 1v1 with a donation. Then say, well, he'd he bet. And he'd say, if you win, I'll pay you money. Uh, what do we have in terms of professional zombies? Nothing really. How about this and the graveyard? Gravestones are quite good in this matchup. Maybe I should save the graveyard to cover his environment, though. I want this to turn to a fire rooster. Or just rats. Or just a cone head. Ten wins, hundred dollar challenge of what's the shape face shows up. Oh, call me on my cell phone. Don't mess. Uh, is there a point of putting a graveyard here? <coughs> Why not? Pretty good, actually. Call me and myself, I'm just chum blocking and drawing the card. Pretty darn good. This is actually a professional. So this will be two. I think we'll just use some combination of these two cards. I'm just trying to think next turn. If we play this now, we'll have still have two left. Now, let's just plumber in. Fruitcake. Have you made a video about the best zombie cards? I, sh I should make a video about what to, what to craft nowadays. So, uh... I'll do that, I'll do that, maybe at the end of the stream, or tomorrow, or something. I need a better shirt for when I do the special ones. <coughs> oh, oh, he covered it. Oh yeah? Oh yeah? Weak stuff out of here. It's a two for two. Cornucopia could definitely get a buff. Listen, if we teleport in gentlemen zombies on turn five, we'll have that. Still not enough. We need to stall for one more turn here. Don't mess. Big fat bubba. How do you get tricksters? You can find them in premium packs or you can craft them. What's today's meta? There's no meta. Every day it seems like it's a different thing. Wow. Okay, that does nothing. I'm gonna put a team up behind that? Oh, that's what he's doing. Okay. Boop. Oh, Nebulae. How about Gentleman Zombie Nebula? the play you guys we got this we got this all set up here the play is we're going to play this we'll actually have seven this turn I'm a professional 
Oh, got Soldier Boy. We're gonna teleport in the Discotron, which Captain Combustible can do nothing about. Then this is gonna pop out next turn, and we are going to um, and we are going to Guard Feast. It's perfect. Yep. We'll we'll actually just teleport right here, prevent the three damage. Cause why the heck not? Teleport. Yes, we're pulling it off, you guys. We're pulling it off. <laughs> and he has no way of dealing with gravestones, too. That's a great thing. This is perfect. Is this a joke deck? It's for sure a joke deck. Yes! Discotron incoming. This is the first time I've ever pulled this combo off, and it's going to be great. Oh, here he comes. No one cares. We'll leave maybe Heights Lane open for Soldier Boy. That'll be fun. Okay, that happens. No one cares. Seriously, no one cares. Hmm. Go get him, Discotron. Go get him. <laughs> Come on, we need a good one here. <laughs> Let's go. Come on, Zombot. Oh, another Discotron. <laughs> oh, wait. We get Octo Zombie against these freaking guys, and they're actually not going to do the double strike, so the Octo Zombie will live here. And we got a different Discotron. Oh, that's good. Well, it's just going to be another Baboon Rising. See, the, the frenzied attacks go before double strike, and dead minions, don't, they'll do it for their first strike, but not their second, so. He's down to three. Yo, dead. Keep going. One more Bad Moon Rising. No! Oh, damn! That was bad. That was very bad, you guys. Ah, we have another Octo Zombie there. No one cares. Did he get this from uh, from Exploding Fruit Kick? Uh, uh, I'm just gonna give this guy nightmares about about freaking Disco Chan. Oh, Soldier Boy to face would have won. Oops, Soldier Boy to face would have won. <laughs> no one cares. Listen, guys, no one cares. <laughs> we'll still pull it off. We just gotta proc the block this turn, okay? Ah, uh, that would have been the good, the good finish. Soldier boy, <laughs> my bad. It's fine. We're still gonna pull it off. Play another minion. No wait. Oh no, it's not. He doesn't realize it's not gonna help. Ah, uh, yes. I'll Oh, okay, so this is... Oh, no. Uh, <laughs> okay, he's gonna block and get Meteor, okay? Then Soldier Boy will get the big finish. Listen. Listen. Mm -mm -mm. Uh, damn! <laughs> no, I ruined it! <laughs> no! Ah, <laughs> uh, I missed the Soldier Boy to face. Oh, well. I was gonna make our, our score 12, but we'll only make it 8 then. We did pull off, we did pull off this good try Bad Moon Rising. We'll get the Soldier Boy next time, you guys. Ah, feels bad, man. What's going on, JJ? Um, Pine Clone Cycle Cat. That's what I usually do on the end. <laughs> nice hand. Ah, it's just perfect. That's a pretty good hand, actually. <coughs> We got the early game removal, we got the late game removal, we got the guys set for Bad Moon Rising. How does one do a stream? You just download OBS and trying to figure out. I, I'm, I should make a tutorial, a streaming tutorial at some point. <sighs> okay, it's, it's time. It's time to do that. I want to make a comprehensive streaming tutorial that literally tells you every single thing you need to do from beginning to end, step by step, and Lily sucks. That's why. Used to be good against Brainstorm. What is Brainstorm going to do on turn two against Lily? Nowadays, that's I could have used my fruitcake, but that still would have given him an advantage. <laughs> Everyone's like, bro, use Lily, it's still good. No, no. It's only good against bad players. Uh, just go. Damn. 
Ah, go proc his block. Call proc the block. This is a non grave buster hero, so we have two of those in a row. <laughs> You're trying to put overlays on your stream, but okay. I'm. I should make that tutorial. It's not just gonna be for our community. It's not gonna be for our community at all. It's just gonna be a real good guide on how to stream every single thing you need to know. I, I don't know if I'll even <laughs> but I get views for that. You know what? We need more cards. This guy's doing it looks like a bunch of random cards thrown into a deck. He has cl click peas. Maybe this is an onion rings deck. I bet it, we're gonna see onion rings actually. I don't know when set five is gonna come out. How, what? I'll do more. Okay, you go away. Goes on. Oh, baby! Cards. Trixie is at four, by the way. Just saying. Wow, we can actually go Egg Discotron. How great is this? This is turn six. Egg makes seven. Wait a second. Well, okay. We can either go Egg. We could go Bad Moon Rising this turn if we want. The other play, in fact, we can go Beam Me Up Bad Moon Rising. The other play is just going to be Teleport Discotron. This is really, really good. We have Bad Moon Rising. Yeah. On what device am I playing this game? It's on my phone and I'm screen mirroring it to my computer. I'll probably have a small section in the, in the streaming tutorial of how to actually make, uh, how to actually stream from your phone, which is a completely separate thing. <clears throat> that happened. Doesn't want that to hatch. We can still beam me up. Baboon Rising. This turns into a active ability guy. Okay. Alright. Looking good. Oh baby. We're gonna be able to teleport Trickster after this is done. Uh, we can actually teleport Trickster this turn also. That's insane. Here's a Trickster. There's Soldier Boy. <laughs> Look at this insane play. Yeah, because I feel like it. That's why. Bloody. <laughs> Doesn't do much. It's fine. We're healing back up to 18. Hmm. <laughs> Give that man a Doom Shroom. Hello, nurse! We played enough things and ramped enough there to actually get the trickster in at the end of the turn. And here's six more damage to your face! Hello, nurse is correct. Ooh, got a bungee plumber, that's nice. So we're just gonna Nebula and bungee plumber here. And uh, we'll just go try next turn, I guess. <coughs> you know, we killed his coin. He prevents us some damage in lane one, and again, we put another big minion on the field. Smarter play would have been to hold the trickster there and get him with it next turn, but. You got three tricksters from a Bad Moon Rising once? It's amazing. Soldier Boy's the weakest link. Maybe he'll bounce the Soldier Boy somehow. Uh, Chomsil will conjure a card that can bounce Soldier Boy and then we'll actually get Soldier Boy to face for the win. That's the dream, you guys. He's just not taking out the nurse, he's just taking out the trickster and stuff. Because, because he's afraid of tricksters. Do we win? Heal! So, there's a part of me that wants to win, and there's a part of me that says, I don't even care. Should I play this? We're gonna go for Garg Face. See how far we can BM this guy. 
I know Bungie Plumber was the correct play there, but no one cares. I'm just trying to increase our troll score, okay? Our troll score is definitely 13 by now. Definitely gotta be in double digits. La dee da. <laughs> See, if he destroys both of these, we'll actually ramp. Rye Rose and a bunch of Flyros wouldn't be bad. Okay, Lawnmower. That's nice. But no more healing? Okay, he's running Flourish. That's nice. This is able to make a guy. <laughs> Go get him, Disco Tron. Go get him. Go dead. And... <laughs> no one cares! Watch him just get Scorch here. Scorch wouldn't help. Super certainly wouldn't help. Super kills this one. Well, nah, that's guaranteed. Alright. Heal we already used. Oh no, it's Scorch! He'll survive one more turn so Trickster will kill him instead of Soldier Boy. He, he actually did. That was a good play because he played around the embarrassment of getting killed by Soldier Boy on the ground like, Come on, think about it. BM value. Keep it going. Spiritin's always keeping track of what our actual wins and losses are. Outside of our troll score or whatever we happen to be doing that day. So thank you, Spiritin. We're 2-0 oh now. I think we're 3-0 oh if you count that first game. <clears throat> the guy did concede, okay? He couldn't deal with the beam yet. We were definitely way ahead there. I know it's a combo, but we'll get back later. Come on, Wingnut. Shut up. We did get Nebula against Solar Flare, so. If I play this on one, I'm gonna stall. I'm not really doing anything to get damage in early. The game really starts once you either have a Trickster or a Bad Moon Rising setup. If he puts a Solar Winds, we have the easy, two easy answers to that. Three, four. It's Nebula time, babies. Plain environment. Did they really come a set five on third of August? What? <clears throat> I haven't heard anything. Is there even a PVZ Heroes website? I'm googling PVZ Heroes. Official EA site. Oh baby, it's Nebula. Oh baby. Oh, Let's just start with that. We can do Bad Moon Rising on a single minion, why not? Hammer! We don't have it still though, right? Because this will be... Nah. Wait, this will give us six. Teleport them out. Gentlemen. Ladies and gentlemen. Uh, so this will, again, if we were to play this, we would have six. really want to play the Discotron. Teleport Discotron would be amazing next turn. <clears throat> I'll do this as a setup play. The main thing we want to do is teleport Discotron. Could have actually teleported this one in. Would have been smarter. We can actually do this already if we want. Oh, it's Terak. Oh, he's inside the uh, 
Tarak Obagi, the person we're actually playing against is in the chat now. Don't snipe, man. You're in for a surprise. We're using a new concept today. Don't look at my deck, Tarak. I'm with Fry, help. Okay, so it's gonna be teleporting this one in. It's unless he covers the Nubby lower fly. Actually, if he either one of these would work. In fact, we could ban Moon Rising right now if he doesn't actually outright kill the gentleman zombie. <clears throat> that's fine. That's fine. Wow. That's a that's a body on the field. But the bodies hit the field. Huh? So we could bad moon rising right now. But what fun would that be? What fun would that be, you guys? Ooh, another one. Here we go. I could have bad moon rising up there. We definitely have much more potential now. La di da di da. <laughs> He's getting ready for impact. He's getting ready for impact. This teleport Discotron into Bad Moon Rising. <clears throat> Amazing! So we're actually ramping a whole lot right now. Uh huh? You can actually replay a, um. You can actually play another Nebula now this turn. After we do this. What's in the box? Oh, it's Samba! What do you know? <laughs> This will actually draw us a gourmet card because of freaking, um, because of that. Oh, look! Leftovers! I love leftovers. Uh, what shall we do here? <laughs> I think we'll start by proccing his block. Yes, got him! So that's nine damage. That was a nine damage plumber, by the way. <laughs> oh no! And we have basically guaranteed lethal here. In fact, we can move it up to 16. Oh, let's just go with this. Enjoy! <laughs> That's what we got from our King of the Grill Zombot combo. Uh, uh, yeah, I'm rolled one. <laughs> got him. Got him. Uh, that was a good highlight. I really, I did not go into today's stream thinking about Teleport Discotron into Bad Moon Rising. What an amazing combo. That could just be the whole deck. And thank you so much. Uh, that was Tarak, who actually just subscribed. So thank you so much for the uh, Twitch Prime sub. That was, I just played against you. Good game. Good game, Tarak. Tarak? Tarak Obagi? Tarak Obagi. Deserve the sub for killing Oh, that was good. I'll write that down as the highlight, I guess. Oh, we got a trickster. Uh, did I add enough to the troll score there? Let's just make it an easy, even 40. It's perfect. Ooh, telepathy. I'll take it. This is 08. Wow, it's August already. How the months go by. How the months go by. Uh, this will be... Zombot. There we go. Plop is such a good power. Such a good power. Wow, it's another trickster. Another one. <clears throat> Z-Mac egg deck again? Yeah, I could. I could pick it back. Have an egg splash. Is aggro's great? Aggro Rose is fine. It's not as good as Solar Flare. Even Wall Knight would be better. Oh, wh what a freaking shame. What a freaking shame. Grave Flick. Wall Knight is Grave Buster, so. 
You're saying more than the Solar Flare. It doesn't have a <clears throat> Poison Ivy, which is one of the best best cards. Rose's powers are also really not good for aggro. Solar Flare's powers are way better. Um, I don't think I do anything here. This plumber beam me up inside. Love you, Sansy. Why do you love me so much, Sansy? You've been giving me so much love. What is this? Is it possible to clip your game? Yeah. You can find it. Well, it's in all the Twitch Twitch things are recorded. What do I do about that? Beam me up, plumber. Or just beam me up. Probably just... On what device do I play this game? I play it on I play it on my phone. It's a Galaxy S8, and I'm it's actually attached with USB cable to my computer. Um, and I did it that way. Another game mechanics video. Yeah, I'm I'm gonna be working hard on some videos. Maybe that's just what I'll do today. I don't really have plans. I gotta 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 start start going. I'm gonna be working on YouTube a lot soon. Do I just play this? Yeah, why not? <laughs> I think the fruit cake is better on the Sergeant Strongberry next year. Even though that would have worked too. Ooh, a teleport. Why don't I use an Android emulator? Because they're glitchy. There's two Android emulators, Bluestacks and Nox, and both of them have had a lot of issues. Performance issues. The best way is to play on a phone, which is its natural thing, and to screen mirror. Screen mirroring has its own amount of issues too. I've just found that this way makes the smoothest stream, the highest quality, and the least amount of disconnects. I used to go on Knox and it would just disconnect from the internet randomly all the time. So, but you can you can do it from an emulator. I, I did stream for uh, a lot of times from a, from an emulator. Most mostly it's been screen mirroring though. I can do top cards. What is this? Very blast. <laughs> Let's go Egg Valley. Oh, don't mess with eggs. So the question is, we have now six. I'd like to teleport Trickster. Well, let's say we're teleport Trickster in this turn. Give up the other egg. What's your your name, Fry? In real life, name is Ephraim, uh, which in Hebrew is pronounced Ephraim, so people just always called me Ephraim or Fry growing up, so I prefer Fry. Uh, I can check the extra. Brain Vendor. Again, you'd have to take things out. It just seemed like all the cards in this deck were more necessary for either controlling or ramping than Brain Vendor. Brain Vendor is good. It doesn't do a ton, you know? Now we have a lot of brains. So I can fruitcake if I want. Let's start with Teleport. See what it gives us. Yeah, oh, that's good. That's really good. That's perfect, actually. No need to free take here. And we'll go with the expensive one. That's 12 damage. Amazing! Uh, in flow, it does it says you're not sub. It says you have Twitch Prime, but you're not you're not subbed anymore. Thank you so much for subbing in flow in the future. Uh, in the present. Present thinking, you guys. I think we'll do it like this. Try to clear this lane just for the trickster here. Huh? We'll play the trickster when it's more useful. We still have fruitcake this turn. Not in that much trouble. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, baby. What's in the box? Two attack. Oh, that's not bad. More ramp. No one cares. No one cares. <coughs> Want a toxic waste dip. Look! Oh, it's not summoning. Actually, it would have made the imp automatically go here. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Good. OTK ringleaders, right? <laughs> no, he rolled a three. Good. Just play one of our tricksters already. Ooh, a gentleman. Ah, I kill you. Where is Baboon Rising? Where's Garg Feast, actually? That's the real question, you guys. Oh, baby, Melon Pult. Melon Pult. All these brains, nothing to do with it. Ah, we have guarantee we will. Uh, actually, you can roll three and three now. Die. We am throwing in. Oh, Jimmy Neutron. That's nice. Clank. He's doing trade. So he needs double threes in order to survive. I kind of want to get a Garg Feast or something, though. I don't know. <laughs> Let's just go Ultimate BM. I don't even care. <laughs> Miss Lethal on purpose. We'll try to Nebula. Really want to get a Baboon Rising or a Garg Feast in this game against the stupid Spadow that I don't even know what he's running. What is this? Weedle? Send me a deck. That out. Is it a berry deck or what? This is a control bounce. Espresso Fiesta. I just don't see the high attack minions besides for really expensive sap fling that you're going to be able to use your bonus attacks on. I guess you can grow minions. I'd say you'd have to have some harder actual hitting minions, like, you know, B-Rex or something like that. Okay, really? Really? I can always trickster at any point in time here. Squirrel! Oh, this would be good with Garg Feast! Fine, I'm gonna have to kill you. Reluctantly. <sighs> can't really with this guy on. Oh, yeah. And thank you so much. Tack I still again. can't believe I played you live. Love your videos a lot, Fry. You're my favorite PVZ Heroes streamer and would love you play with you again. GLHF. Thank you so much, Tarek. Really, really appreciate it. And good game before. He was the Solar Flare that we played before. They were the Solar Flare, I should say. So, really, really appreciate it. GLHF. Good luck. Have fun. There you go. Thank you so much for the donation. And we're still BMing, by the way. We just missed Lethal again for the second time. This is fun. I'd like me. The only thing you could do right now is actually pop in poppies. That would be really, really sad. But yeah, we are BMing this guy to the Ice Age. No poppies! Popping poppies would suck here. <laughs> they see me moving. I'm grooving. <laughs> that is harsh. 55, babies. 55. Got him. And we're casually 4 0. Oh. Yeah, I know, I'm so mean. We missed lethal with two tricksters there. Walnut bowling. Wasn't it only turn eight? Uh, good point. It wasn't a brain fart, you guys. They did it on purpose, okay? Looking for a trickster? <coughs> okay. Looking for a telepathy. Didn't get any bad moon risings that game, though. Disappointed. What's going on, Nut Sunday? How you doing? What day is it today? Not Sunday, don't worry about it. Die. Man, man's running the splash down. It's aggro citron, you guys. Full score is over 9,000 already. Alright. 
We just reacting. Uh, I should have burned a teleport for a card there. Whoops. Whoopsie daisy. Okay, now I'm definitely gonna do it. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Now I have to use all my resources on your face. Bad. Pirate would have been nice. Oh, Nebula, huh? Could have Molecule. What the heck? Okay, really? Th this is how this is going now, huh? I need cards. <laughs> there you are. There you are. <coughs> All graved up and ready to go. <clears throat> oh, here we go. So it begins. Let's open a nebula. We can actually Garg Feast right now if we want. Garg Feast right now? We got seven. <laughs> no one cares! <laughs> oh, that's pretty cool. Uh, not gonna do anything. Plank Walker would have been nice. Oh well. I don't have any real way of moving this. Uh, egg, nah. This thing is doing so much damage though. What's going on, Corn You Coblet? Wow, Brainana! Get wrecked! Brainana's so good. I think we missed both guys. There. Now we have this piece of garbage. Could you stop playing every anti-trick card in the game? Holy smokes! Why? Wow! This is the anti-brainstorm Citron. There is nothing we can do about that. Holy moly with that. This happens. I don't even know what to do here. What can we possibly do? We lose. He's doing four damage a pop. Wait a second. Oh, sucks. <laughs> It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. It's guaranteed lethal. It doesn't even matter. There's nothing we can do. It's freaking Sporticus. You can kiss my ass. Yay! <laughs> I'm increasing the troll score because we just got trolled by every single card that counters our deck. That was insane. Double Sporticus. He had. How many? He played three Sporticuses there, right? Three Sporticuses and a Brainana, great. And then Citron Super, which Brainstorm cannot even touch his minions anymore. We have plenty of removal there. Damn, son. <laughs> uh, Kid Puggy, Kamusta, my boot tea. How you doing? I haven't seen you in a long time. <laughs> uh, la 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 la. If we get some tricks, this will be good. I'll get rid of one trickster. There you go. I'll play this. It's the same guy. I remember. I'm a walnut. I want to play against Citron again. Holy smokes. Oh, baby, we got the combo. We got the combo. It's the same guy? Is it really? This is not? No, it's not the same guy. You think fruitcake looks like the middle finger? Oh baby. Oh baby, it, it does. <clears throat> okay, really? Really now? Fry run. 
Hold on, I'm looking at the YouTube stream. You can tell if it's the same guy. Last guy, last time the guy's name was freaking. Is it cut off? No, don't say it's cut off. It should not be cut off on the YouTube stream. I'll change it. Why is it cut off? Oh, damn, it is cut off. Need to edit the scene here. There. Oh. Pass. It's not the same guy? Okay. <laughs> no, it's not the same deck. Not at all. Not at all, Morty. Not at all. Do you teleport for a card? Uh, yeah. Another one. <coughs> Another teleport. How do you share your deck? Take a screenshot with Imger. Uh, I think we'll go with Double Plumber. The fruitcake is, is really necessary against the pecan a lot, so. <laughs> Uh, keep it going. You can always teleport Trickster now. At any point in time. But he doesn't bring Anos. Another teleport. I'll probably teleport Trickster here just to put on the heat. Then 6, 7. Uh, I think it's how we're gonna do it. Teleport in Torb. Fry shout out. Please, I like your stream. It always cheers me up. What's going on? Welcome to the stream, Aksuki Gaming. Much appreciated. Okay, you go away. First of all, <laughs> it's the Starch Lord deck. Teleport. Teleport again. Another Batman Rising. And we'll go with this. See you later. Go get him. Disco Tron. Go get him. Deathly Spaghetti sending me a meme probably. <laughs> Stalling for time, folks. Ending a match in a respectful manner. Hemming someone. <laughs> Definitely true. Uh, he's, we're gonna be like one off of lethal now. We're one off of lethal, you guys. And we have a full board for this Bad Moon Rising, so no one cares. Against a guy that really cannot feel clear at all. All I get fully feel clear he card has is, is like Shrinking Violet, and that only takes out one of these minions, so. I think we're good for the Bad Moon Rising, you guys. Nice shirt, Daddy. Yeah, I know, seriously. Oh, he's healing! He's healing for four! Oh, he, he just got saved. I'm telling you, that was it. That was it. He's gonna win now. Hey, is that a regular beans, Magic Beanstalk? Hey. It's shiny, so. Go get him! Go get him! And. Oh, coffee! Oh, that's crazy! These gargs are bullseye now! Now it's guaranteed lethal just in lane one because we got coffee wizard! Come on, man! It's not even fair! Damn, Moon Rising is the best card in the game. Come on. Craziness. Is Rustbolt or Brainstorm better for Trickster decks? Brainstorm's better because he's able to control better than Rustbolt. Rustbolt does, has no answers to cards like, um... No, no answers to cards like, 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 like Haunted Pumpkin except for his ultimate power, I guess. You need, you need, you know, to do, deal two damage in control decks, typically. Oh, baby. Oh, it's, it's going down. The makings of a good ramp, of a good game. Okay, you're re-initiating. 
Wow, wow, are you annoying? Ooh, is this boy annoying? Mm -hmm. What level are you? Because I haven't played the game in a while. I'm, I'm ultimately. Are you kidding me? No, forget me nuts is a major problem. Come on, squirrel. <laughs> that would have been so good. <laughs> Why did you move that? Piece of trash. Three spadows in a row. Uh, the last two were citrons. I think they'll just beat me up, I think. This forget me nuts is a major problem, though. Do they have enough of a fruitcake here or something? Move out the way! He's trying to move here. Move, Citron. Get out the way. What if we go with this and go for the big play next turn or something? I don't know. Sometimes, I just don't know. Alright, let's do this. Yeah, I know. There's some squirrels out of these. These eggs gotta turn into squirrels. It's our only chance. I'm just ruining all of our prospects of getting the Garg Beast in right now. But anyway, we can play Eureka. Maybe Eureka will give us a squirrel. Come on, squirrel! Or exploding fruitcake. Or anything. This happens. Go to lane three. I don't mind if this actually blocks this one. <laughs> nice track. Ramp. On life. Oh. Okay. I see, I see what you're saying. So we can either go with these two. I'm pretty sure we need to Eureka of the sorts. Let's see what we get. Huh? In fact, this blocking, this blocking will, uh, could actually end up growing this. Did we use something here? No, this was just, this was an egg. Yes, yes, so I'm like the party grows to 3-3 three, three now. Amazing! Well. Alright, we're doing just fine, you guys. We can play bats in the water. That'll be fun. No. It's beam me up. Just stall him for time. So if he kills, when he kills the 3-1, we'll be able to beam me up here and actually replay another Nebula, which is nice. No! Didn't do it. Okay, I, I see what I see what you're saying. Kinda see what you're saying. Alright, so so it begins. Uh, do we want this in the empty lane or in the other lane? I'd say... I'd say it doesn't matter. We got double Nebula happening now. The high diver, which is not really good. Huh? At least our tricks are feeling good. He wasn't able to capitalize on this on this tempo lead at all. There's a butt. Th th there's a butt. Uh. -huh. We can actually trickster now if we want. Sounds good to me. We're actually gaining too, so we can still beam me up. If we so desire. If we if we so desire. Hey, Dandelion King, really? You think you're gonna win, huh? That, that's how you think this is gonna go down. Uh, I think we'll play around Berry Blast. gonna roll one anyway. Watch this. Watch this. Right here. Wrong this one. Just because of this guy, how scrubby he is. Damn. Cutest plants in it? Sounds good to me. Ah. Uh, make it rain. Make it rain. Damn. That sucks. Ah. Uh, oh, that's bad. Plumber, plumber, does not get it done. So it actually has to be like this now. 
They'll still be able to plumber plumber you guys. Just means if he does can kill this, then uh... Plumber Plumber is still working. No one cares. <laughs> We're actually gonna win. Yes! <laughs> you got him, High Diver. He'll be doing two damage to me. And I'll be doing six damage to his face. Good job, Trickster. You got the job done. You did it. He thought teaming up. Oh, I'll, I'll just team up. It'll be fine. Hello, Darkness. Let's weak stuff out of here. Absolutely ruined that guy. Wasn't even close, you guys. He wasn't even close. Weak stuff out of here. Hail the conquering hero! In fact, if we would have saved the rain... Anyway. Keep it going. The ultimate troll. I know. Even when you try your best, you really must concede. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, oh, we got Trickster. Oh, we got Summoning. Ever want to make a Zombot deck? I don't know. I'm so happy we did not see Forgive Me Nuts. I've tried a bunch of Zombot decks in the past. It's not really good. <coughs> oh no, it's Siege Room! What are we gonna do? So it's a mushroom deck, and we're gonna just gonna see Punish Room here. Play an environment. That happens. Yo, dead. That was one of his environments. It just makes the Nebula safer. Just so much safe. I don't know. We can go three, one, and two if we want. I don't know, because I feel like it. No! <laughs> Not even necessary! All part of my plan, folks. It was all part of my elaborate plan. Oh, skill over 2,000. That's right. Someone clip that. Damn, son. We're going to get the Guard Feast. They're the Baboon Rising soon. It's not even fair. <laughs> I'm adding 10 points of troll just for that move. We're going to get into triple digits here, you guys. Okay, really? Really? Freaking kidding me? Wow. I'll kill this before it's too late. We're gonna get another one, don't worry guys. Is this the same guy as last time? Oh, a bungee! Well, that's nice. So just go with these two. Yeah, why not? Wow. Carry Zombot can take care of him too. Lock. Backup dancers. Oh baby! <laughs> it's perfect. This is turn exactly seven though, right? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Bad moon rising time, babies. One play, three clips. The squirrel was real. Let's see if he has removal. Damn it. Damn it. Oh, my God. 
Oops, no, I should have gone here. My bad. I wonder how this affects. Does this trigger the ne does the nebula actually trigger here? Cause if it did, it would be awesome. It does. Cool. Wait. So this will cost three. This will cost one. Oh, so we can do this now. Bam. He's moving that. That's fine. We'll still get our nebula. Oh, that's good. Alright, Zombot, we need you. We need you, Zombot. Or just Discotron. Could you stop, really stop doing that? Oh, this, this guy's really annoying. Ugh, okay. Might as well. Give me something good. Oh, uh, damn, it really sucks. What are we gonna do now? I need a Discotron. Oh! You guessed it! Um. Uh, I guess this has to go here. No, nah, we're still alive. We got this. Mm. <coughs> we're doing just fine. Okay. Did he get this from the fruitcake? No. Oh. It's fine. We're doing just fine. Let's get a fruitcake this one. Ah, level three. We're doing just fine here. Uh, we got Trickster coming in. All we need is the top deck of Garg Face and we'll be okay. Look, we're blocking. Even block two damage doesn't even help. Ah, uh, there you go. Why would you meteor that? Wait! It dies anyway! Wow, totally wasted his meteor. Come on, Garg Feast, where are you, Garg Feast? I need ya, I need ya, I need ya right now. I need you right now. So don't let me, don't let me. Come on, we have two in our deck. Ah, don't. Huh? Okay, this is still doable, you guys. This is still doable. We're gonna teleport this one in and Garg Feast it. And, and Baboon Rising it. This is fine. We're, we're in good shape here. We did get teleport, you guys. We're holding on for dear life. Uh huh. That's fine. We're okay. Teleport. gotta be egg well come on okay that works die We're doing just fine here you guys where's garg feast Garg feast! Trickster? This actually hunts, which is really nice. So we'll do this. See, if he puts a guy here, it's gonna hunt it down, so he needs two guys now. Maybe he doesn't have two guys. Oh, he has five cards in his hand. Okay. Wow, there's some godlike plays here. Just godlike plays. Damn. <laughs> no! <laughs> we almost did it! We almost did it. <laughs> oh well. Fine, we'll add one point for his trolliness there. Ah, this salt. 
We're actually six and two still with this deck. Where's Garg Feast? We needed Garg Feast. We would have won the game. Come on, man. Where did that go wrong? That freaking Gravitry really got us. We don't actually have any answers in this deck to Gravitry. That's the problem. Except for um, Baboon Rising into Zombot. It's basically the answer. Come on, man. Wario Garlic? A bloom? Bloom everywhere. Okay. Oh, baby. This is a good hand. It's a good old. <laughs> you eat the time, baby. I want my Soldier Boy back. As redemption. And thank you so much, Bit Tilp, for Three subscribing. Three months on Twitch. Three Twitch Prime subs to you. Really, really appreciate it. Three months in a row. B Tilp. Thank you so much. It seemed like that thing was a little low. It must have gotten knocked down. Where's the um, stream alerts? That must be on the top here. Twitch alerts. There. Now it's all fixed. Keep it going. <clears throat> yeah, we'll try to kill our opponent before they play Banana Dragon Fruit. Teleporting in Tricksters is barely even a thing. Because you just gotta play around right now. Oh, <laughs> this is a, look what we just got, this heal is not that important, but we freaking got mustache mounting it with some tricksters on deck, I'll definitely take it, then we have, this is three tricks, you guys, that's how that goes, oh, we give egg just to stall for time, aha, don't mess with the almighty egg, thanks for reading it, should win the next game, you guys are so nice, uh, Cassio, Bagal is sending me a thing. Fake Swarm. <laughs> Why do you have Weenie Beanie, though? Get rid of Weenie Beanie. That Weenie Beanie, this deck would be good. Put in some, like, uh, Pine Clones instead. Or just another Bean would be. Would be cool on the other Bean. Wow, that's not bad. It's not bad at all. I'll just thinking game now. We do have a Guard Feast. We have heal, so we have sustain. Uh, one three is fine. Being there, done that. We'll do that before it grows. We'll be able to play this in one of the next week. Keep it going, keep it going, imp throwing imp. It's a teleport. I need you, I need you, I need you right now. I need you. <laughs> He's spending an ice board. Wow. This is just <laughs> a troll deck. What is he doing? What is this man even doing? Okay, that happened. Go get him, thinking cat. Backup dancers and lightning bolt. Lightning bolt's one of the most powerful ones. And this will work eventually with the... Uh, Bad Moon Rising. I think I'll save it. There's no point. It's too damage. See? It's all part of my elaborate plan. Any way we can ramp here? This is really turn 8. Let's just do this. We're not teleporting these tricksters in anyway. Could try teleport trickster here actually. Oh, uh, fine. Brain Nano would be good. It's not even that en end of the world because we're still so high in health. So we can actually lightning bolt teleport trickster right now. Monument trickster. Oh, we'll, we'll have it set up, you guys. Don't worry. We can actually trickster monument trickster. <laughs> this is kind I don't understand. Here's the teleport. No, I think this is the play now. Uh, yeah. Now we have a big thing happening. It's fine. <coughs> Go! So now we have the backup dancers. It's turn seven, we have backup dancers. Bam Moon Rising and Plumber. We want. Watch out for Weenie Weenie. This is such a meme deck, by the way. 
What is our opponent even doing? Okay, that happens. Okay, that happens. It's like OTK. Watch. Here he goes. Here he goes. With, here comes the weenie beanies, you guys. Here they come. No, don't balance that. We have 11 cards in our hand, by the way. Just saying. That happens. Huh? We're just gonna get summoning anyway. It's fine. Summoning! Oh! More backup dancers! Damn! He missed! It's okay, draws a card. That's alright. So we have backup dancers, Bad Moon Rising, with a full field right now. We have these two cost tricksters. Those will happen eventually. No dragon! Please, no dragon. No dragon! In fact, can we. Can we. Oh, we can actually stuff the dragon with the fruitcake. Fruitcake's actually an answer to dragon. Oof. This will be the double backup dancer, Bad, Bad Moon Rising. Love the Garg Feast eventually, too. Are you kidding me? Ah. <laughs> Prepare to meet your maker! Let's go! These guys cost zero, by the way. Oh, a little bit of splash. Interesting. That survives. Boop. <laughs> Didn't get the thing. So kill all those. Now what you got? Now what you got? <coughs> Weed whack. Okay. I don't like the splash one, I guess. <laughs> don't mess with egg. Egg is too OP, you guys. Beam me up inside. We will heal our face. We're definitely stalling for this guard feast, you guys. It's definitely what's happening. I'm just making sure we don't die in the meantime. So we have beam me up and two fruit cakes. These tricksters cost zero, by the way. Just saying. Okay. Now what you do? Now what'll it be? Oh, oh, our opponent's trying to freeze. Oh, I see. I see how it's going. I see how it's going down for real. Go get him, Egg. Go get him. Huh? Zookeeper. Doesn't help. Die. Now our tricksters will give us brains when we play them. They're well below zero. <coughs> Another two damage. Got the full block meter now. We need Garg Feast, you guys. It's either Garg Feast or Garg Feast. I have to play Garg Feast one time today. Come on. Oh, yeah. Thanks so much, Energy. I was watching your YouTube video. Then I remembered you stream. Haha. -ha. Thank you so much, Energy. Really appreciate it. What is this? Pear Paradise? Got that from a fruitcake. Welcome to the stream inflow. Whoa, uh, yeah, that doesn't actually make a second one. Nice try. <laughs> In fact, you should have made this on the side, because, you know. Because, you know. Get weak stuff out of here. Enough time. Actually, we should have killed something. Should have let one of our own guys die so the Garfield can actually make an extra dude. Whoops. Is the Garfield's not even good yet? I should have let him die. This opponent is useless, by the way. Oh, baby! The one guard guard feast. Could you just shrinking violet all my guys here, please? Pretty, please? Oh, yeah! Cornucopia! What does he get? Just destroy. Some field clear. Let's go. It's fine. We'll guard feast next turn. Oh, a second one! Did he get any team ups? No. Uh. Garkfeast doesn't even do anything here. Garkfeast will work next turn, you guys. Let's see what this turns into. He got two cornucopias. 
Doesn't even do anything. Our field will be nice and cleared. I think our opponent's game just soft locked because of the double cornucopia shtick. I can't do it yet. Okay, so this happens. Let's see what the fig, fig turns into. The fig's totally in the wrong place here. Uh, eh. Does nothing. That happens. Uh, cards, sure. Alright, listen. <laughs> this is how we're doing this. <laughs> this is how we're doing this play, you guys. <laughs> Get these weak cornucopias out of here! <laughs> oh no, wait! Oh, I don't have the guard feast now! Whoops! Oops! Wait, how did that. Oh, because the three from the mustache monument. Oh, my bad. Uh, we're gonna have to wait one more turn, I guess. Uh, okay. Uh, what's the play now? This is tough. This is tough. Oh, we have a teleport. So we'll just decide later. My bad. If we would have actually put the gentleman zombie, we would not have this predicament. Sorry, sorry. I thought it was a good play though. It was very good BM. Shut up. We're definitely at 101 by now, okay? 101 Dalmatian BMs. I'm gonna shrink you this number a little bit. It's too big. The BM is way too big for the score. Slot card thing. Melon pulled. Sorry. So Canadian, I know. Okay, if it was that. I don't have any amphibious minions right there. Okay, just made two of these. Are you kidding me? The past is in the past. Let it go, let it go. <clears throat> We're doing just fine here. He's doing five. Who cares? Now we guard feast. Today is the day, you guys. We can guard feast and beat me up if we want. No one cares. If it's Bray Nana right now, yeah, we're screwed, but it's fine. Ah. Uh, uh oh. Uh, <laughs> freeze that. Come on. Pass. Can't actually play Brain N anymore, that's the good news. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh. <laughs> you think that's gonna save you? Uh oh. No. Not Brain Anna. Anything. Thank you. Uh, uh oh. No. Actually, in big trouble here. Do we have to use this summoning? So we guarantee get something in the water lane? Because if one of these gargs don't end up in the water lane, we're screwed. So we actually have to use summoning. So one of the guards definitely go to the water lane. Really? Come on! Let's go, Zombot, where are you? And... Wait. Wait. Oh, this will kill everything. <laughs> wow, hold on. That hits. Wait, no! Oh, he actually does no damage! Wow, that was such a good, that was so amazing! This is actually gonna heal for six now. That was crazy! That actually prevented the four damage there. Absolutely fantastic, you guys. 
That was good. That was very good. So we can go 8 plus 6. It's perfect. Die! I'll go with this one. This way, if our opponent removes anything, we can still fill the lanes. Clutch nurse? You don't understand how good the, the gas giant was there. Our opponent was was gonna hit us for four on one we were gonna be down to one health instead we end up with 11 since this splash damaged killed everything in fact the gas giant exploding right now is just gonna get it done ah. in fact the six damage will proc the block it's gonna have to then go to fight you can't go to fight this one you can only transmogrify it wait you're hitting that now okay roll one no. It doesn't matter. We're actually going to clog this lane with the Discotron. So the Discotron will pr protect us from the 6 damage. Which is fine. Turning that into a goat. We have the zero cost trickster in our hands at any point in time here. Uh oh. Okay. <laughs> Free something! That happened. You think you're gonna damage me? You'll damage me for two this turn. Enjoy. And draw a couple cards. Is it time to kill this guy already? Actually, do we not even have a trick screen in here? Okay, that happens. Oh yeah, we do. We actually in fact the melon pulls actually won us the game. The Melon Pulse actually won us this game. We don't really have anything fun to do here anymore. <laughs> Goodbye, Rose. It's been nice. We got your hopes all up. How about 111? That looks like a good place to, to keep it. We did Garg Feast, though. We did do it one time, okay? Shut up. <laughs> Amazing. You're right, because the Melon Pulse were able to kill the Trickster, so we could immediately Trickster. Anyway, guys, that's enough of that. Obviously, every single game was just amazing. I think we ended up going, what, 7-2, and two, Spirin says. So, uh, <coughs> really, really pleased with the way that goes. Bad Moon Rising is the event card this week, so go grind them. Just the absolute most fun card ever. I could, I'm going to actually make a budget Bad Moon Rising deck on Free to Play Friday. Uh, so that'll be fun. I'll show you guys how you can really, um, don't even need a lot of cards in order to be able to pull off effective of Bad Moon Rising. One way to do would be with Brainstorm, the other way would be with Super Brain, so I'll try them both. Anyway guys, hope you enjoyed. Peace, this is Friday.